What's going on? Out here today with uh, Dragon Rooms, and we are at Stokes State Forest, New Jersey. It's been a couple years since I've been here, and we're gonna do, um, we're gonna make a loop out of a few of the trails here, and we're gonna go up to the Appalachian Trail and use part of that and go check out the fire tower. So we're gonna head up here and uh, see what we got at Stokes. So we are following the Green Trail, which is uh, appropriately called the Tower Trail, which I didn't realize until we saw it on the kiosk. Um, but I think, pretty sure, this is uh, the little creek that me and Rocco crossed a couple years ago. And then there's snow, and this bridge was not here. It would have been very welcome if there was a bridge here. Um, if you're out here at Stokes, one thing to pay close attention to, they've got these nice discs that they put up, uh, like that one right there. Um, some of the colors are extremely close. Like we were just at an intersection that was green and a blue trail, a brown trail, and another blue trail. And the blues are like slight hue differences off. Um, so keep a map with you and just, you know, that one actually had a, like a, a trail name marker with it too. So we knew which one was which. So they're pretty well marked, but some of the colors uh, have faded on the discs. So they look very similar. So just pay attention as always, but it's easy to get distracted because this is a gorgeous forest. So we have crossed the upper park road and we're on the, uh, the ascent to the Appalachian Trail now. This is, it's not super steep, but it's the steepest thing we've seen so far. Huh, you may think that since there's so many rocks, we're in Pennsylvania. But this is clearly New Jersey. That's straight out. There's a trail, but we don't have a whole lot further to climb. We're up on the ridge and out in like the Pennsylvania, New Jersey area of the Appalachian Trail, it's mostly up on ridges. So, wow, that's a heck of a rock. There's dragon for scale size, I think that's huge. Um, so yeah, with the AT, you climb up a, a gap, and then you get up on the ridge and you walk to the next gap. It's basically what we're doing here. We're just coming up the side of the mountain. Well, this is cool. All right, hold on a second. All right, it's not the best angle of that, but let's try to film that without climbing it twice. So we got a little bit more to climb, looks like. But if you can see right through there, there's blue sky. So we're almost at the top. Oh, our 
first view. made it to the fire tower after a couple of years trying to get up here. It is no trespassing. So no no access up there. That's, I'm not real heartbroken on that. You know how I am with heights. We're gonna figure out which way we're going now. And uh, we gotta figure out, we're all turned around with our direction. So figure out exactly where we are, where we're headed. So we've been coming that direction down the AT. We've just been BSing, not really recording. But we just passed a water crossing that was a little sketchy. Um, and I'm kind of low on water. So we're gonna go down here and go check out the shelter, see if there's either a spring down by that or maybe that water crossing that we goes along there, maybe there's more water in it down that end. So we'll go check that out. I mean, I'm still good on water, but I wouldn't mind having a little more. So we're not far off the AT. Here's the first like tent site here, heading to the shelter. Now this is on the Brown Trail. I just put the map away. I'll put what trail name this is. The Brown Trail, which heads back down the side of the mountain, which we're not gonna take. We're just gonna see how far the shelter is. Um, but yeah, that's pretty nice. Cause I know in New Jersey, you have to camp in designated spot you can't just set up wherever on ET so it's good to know that there's a site like that because that is definitely you could hammock that without a problem I don't know how far we're down we're gonna climb we can make the shelters right back there it's not pretty soon we'll just continue on all right so we came down to check out the shelter which is right up there and there's some people up there and they, they said in the what are you saying? Gut, gut hooks you saw it? Yeah. On gut hooks, it's like good, nice water, one-tenth. So, and there's a sign that says water. So we came down, and um, there's just a frog chilling out in the puddle. <laughs> so not such good water. But this is a nice little shelter. Now, I could probably fit about, I don't know, probably 10 people in there. If you're real close. Yeah. You know? So. Really nice campsites around it. Yeah, and a lot of campsites around it. So we'll take a look at those, too. So that's just common for New Jersey, no fires. This is the Green or Gren Anderson Shelter. Built by the Green Mountain Club. It's just up the Green Mountains. Got a log book. Lots of people have carved their initials and dates and stuff in here. A broom. There's a bear box, which is nice. And the Grand Anderson Appalachian Trail. The, maybe the only downside is that the road is right down there by that water source, which is right down there. So the road is literally like a tenth of a mile away. There's a privy up here. You do the, and these are all campsites here. So there's lots of, lots of room for camping. Go check out the privy. It's raised. There's 
stone in front of it to keep close. But I can already smell it. Hello? Hmm. Not bad. Relatively clean. There's a lock on the door. It's not a rock on the inside. Put that back. Do this so the wind doesn't blow it out. Yeah. It's got a little stink to it, but it's not too bad. It's also not real warm out today. I'll go check out some of these campsites. Oh, I might give that a B. What do you think, John? So this is a really, there's a lot of campsites in here. A lot of spots to camp. Bear boxes, or bear box, I should say. Sturdy. I've seen worse. So we're just hiking along. We see this right off the trail. That looks like it says NJ10. And it's right off the AT. So that may mean uh, 10 miles into New Jersey on the AT. That's what we're thinking. It sounds about right. I mean, we're not far from. Worthington. I don't know. That's hmm. It seems like it would be further. I have to have to measure it out. I'll put it down the bottom if that seems right or not. So we're just past that that marker, you know, a couple hundred yards, heading northbound, and we just came to the next vista. This is, I mean. Just this little section here is gorgeous. All pines. And it's gonna be a little windy, so bear with me, but. Another vista. yellow trail which I think is called the Tinsley trail and we're like we're just off the AT and the road is right down there actually the road is right there <laughs> so once we cross this it looks like there might be another uh, chance for water down here so we're gonna check that out I can't even tell if I'm in frame I'm using my phone for this this hike um, so it doesn't grab as well as the GoPro so I think I'm in frame so here we are at the road. And then we'll cross down to that side. We're gonna hike one of the, the inner loop trails back over to where the car's at. So we just turned off that Tinsley Trail and we're on the Blue Mountain Trail now. There's supposed to be a Swenson Trail that goes with this. I'm gonna link to Dragon's channel. Go watch his video on this because he just explained the whole thing and uh, he did a good job, so. But we're heading, heading the way we want to go. Go. Beautiful whole section of park here. We did uh, just over seven and a half miles, it's almost seven and three quarter miles all the way around. It was a nice hike, and uh, we could do another section of the AT. That's three three states have done the AT in this year. Of course, not through hiking, so it doesn't really count. 
but nice area if you're anywhere near this part of jersey i highly suggest coming out here and checking out stoke state forest it is gorgeous you're not far from worthington state forest which is gorgeous gorgeous and then there's also um high point state park which is the south of us which is or to the north of us which is is nice too i mean i've only been there once so but gorgeous area gorgeous day good to get it, that guy out on a, for a little hiking he's feeling better so that's good that's gonna do it for this one see you in the next